been waiting some time here to put out this information, hoping to get a name, but they still have not released a name. They're stating that an American freelance television cameraman working for NBC News in Liberia has tested positive for the Ebola virus. Now, they're stating he will be flown back to the United States for treatment. As you may recall, Nancy Reitbolt and Kent Brantley were both brought back to Emory Hospital. They both were treated with the ZMAP and released. There were others that came into the United States that were treated as well and also released. Now, the diagnosis of the cameraman, who the network said came down with the symptoms, including headaches, body aches, and fatigue, is believed to mark the first time an American journalist has been infected with the deadly virus since the current outbreak in West Africa began. Now, that's the latest details. As they go on here, they state that the freelancer who NBC said works as a writer as well as a cameraman and whose name was not given by the network is the fourth U.S. citizen overall to have contacted the disease in Liberia. So they're stating that he's 33 years old. And right here, the 33-year-old journalist was hired on Tuesday to serve as a second cameraman for NBC. So that's the risk out here of all things to cover. For a journalist, this proving to be one of the most deadly because you never know where to, where it sits. I'll leave a link, keep you guys posted as I hear more. It's been Dabu 7. Peace.